Let's take a couple of minutes and make some Bluetooth phone calls on Pioneer's AVHX 2800BS. Before we make any phone calls, let's make sure that our phone is connected. So there's a couple of different ways to do that. The first way is to switch to a Bluetooth source, like for example, Bluetooth audio. And uh, let's see, if we're on the time function over here, we want to touch the function button on this side. And here's my telephone list. And you can see right now we have the iPhone 5 and the Nexus 5, but the iPhone 5 is the one that is lit up in blue. So that's the active connected device. And that's what we want there. Another, another way that we can do that is to uh, just touch the telephone button over here. Now if we touch the telephone button, we have uh, a number of different functions that are available here. And you can see that we have the iPhone 5 as the actively connected phone. Once we're in the telephone function, um, we have a couple of different ways to make phone calls. First is our preset dial list, and you can see we have no one in our preset dial list. So let's add someone into the preset dial list. Uh, we'll go to our phone book. We'll touch Percival, and here's Percival's number, and over here, if I touch this button, that will add him into my preset list. Now if I go back up here, you can see the Percival is preset number one. And if we touch that, we can make a call to Percival. And we can touch the red button to hang up. Let's open our uh, phone menu again. And the next thing we see here is our phone book. This button up here with the circle and the arrows means that we can synchronize the phone book. So if we've added some names into our phone book or deleted some names from the phone book, we can synchronize the phone book at any time by touching that button. This is our phone book. It is organized alphabetically. And we can check our incoming and outgoing calls right here. Here's our outgoing calls. Here are our incoming calls. And here are the calls that we missed. Next up is our telephone keypad that you may need to use if you're on a phone call, but you can see that that's grayed out. If I engage the parking brake, you can see that the keypad lights up and I have access to the keypad for uh, punching in a number while I'm on a call. And at the bottom of our list is the easiest way to make a phone call, which is voice dialing. Call Reginald. Calling Reginald. When a call comes in, I can touch the red button to reject the call, or I can touch the green button to answer. In order to make my phone call louder in my car, use the volume button here. Or quieter by turning the volume down. To make the call appear louder to the remote caller, adjust the microphone button here. That's the loudest, the quietest, and in the middle. If I want to pick up my handset and hold the phone to my ear, I can switch on private or switch it back off. And if I need the keypad, I can bring up the keypad here. To end the call, just touch the red telephone button.